Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Welcome back to Ironclad RC. I got a few boats out here at the park pond trying to run them before the storm comes. Uh, I just got 71 mile per hour with the, with the little uh, Blackjack 24, so uh, we're going to run this one. I'm actually going to do a few prop changes in this video. I got a 1917 I want to try, a couple other props, two sets of packs, so uh, grab your popcorn and drinks, but stick around. Big B. We're Ironclad RC. So I'm running an XLX2 Hydra 1600KV 4082X2 motor, Speedmaster hardware, all the everything I'm using, links in the description, you know, to everything I'm using in basically all my boats, you know, so I got the GPS in there, let's get the transmitter turned on here, I'm trying to do this before this rain comes, okay, let's knock this 71 off start that 71 with the with the little 24 it was a I flipped it I flipped it yeah I want to do a couple laps with this prop while I got a fresh battery and then we'll throw a uh, that three blade on it looks like the bottom's about to drop out I programmed, I got that reverse programmed out of this boat. Remember I had put reverse in it in my last video. Whew. Okay, I got my CG a little far forward, feels like. Yep, just a little too far forward, but uh, I'll run it. Sounds good, man. One more lap. And we'll put that three blade on here. I don't even know if it'll take it, to be honest with you. Whew, that's pretty. That's pretty. Let's go, boy. 66 with the two blade here. Uh, we're going to run this three blade. 1916, 1917. Reduced blade area, and it has more rake. So I'm really, really excited to try this on here. I'm gonna get my prop back on real quick. Okay, got the three blade on. Get the 66, I feel raindrops. So I apologize if uh, if the screen becomes blurry or something, not much I can do. All right, so I'm making sure it's not gonna hit my water pickup or my rudder, you know? Let's, uh, let's go. Gonna do a couple laps with it. I don't think it'll take more than that. Temperature wise, you know It's raining it's like a mist so I hope the camera lens is okay Oh that looks good So I'm actually kind of glad I got my CG a little farther forward Plenty of water cooling coming out Yeah, she looks like she's lifting a little bit. So I need to make this this strut dead nuts flat when I run this prop. I got a little up on it right now. That is pretty, man. I want to hit it again, but let's check the temps real quick. That's nice. It's a lot of cooling coming out, both holes. Read 68. That's my PB with this boat. 68. Let's go. Oh, I got a little water in there. My line's on. Let's get that tip gun. All right, so we got a 144, 116. I put my finger on there, I got a cut. I don't know if you guys can see that raw skin right there. <laughs> I put that raw skin on the motor and it scared me. Very sensitive skin. 42, that's, that's good, that's good. 
I don't think I'd want to run it no more than that with that prop on there to be honest with you 68 is freaking awesome man 68 is awesome okay so I want to try this 1921 um, really just curious as to the uh, the ride attitude not really looking for speed it's not an oval prop I'm just really just looking at what it does I've never run it basically just finished it up so just uh, just curious how it runs it's a new prop and all you know okay so this is a 1921 it's not a it's not an oval prop Okay, so it looked like it was with that little bit of up I have for ovals, it was wanting to pick her up. So I may need to go. I may need to go forward on my CG for a speed run and flatten that strut out. Yeah, okay, okay. All right, all right trying to pick out the prop I want to use when I go to the speed run spot <laughs> you know it's a good speed because it was wanting to lift so I couldn't really stay on it 67 okay oh it's actually much cooler than that three blade a lot cooler okay 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 and it wanted to lift so the three blade is my option for speed run all right we'll pull it out there that's good so i'm gonna throw uh i'm gonna throw the 8800s in and we'll we'll do some laps all right I took that 1921 off and I got a 1716 on. 1716. Might be too small for this big boat. Probably perfect for ovals, get it a long run time, you know. Plenty of water cooling coming out. Nice ride attitude. Can basically run it at full trigger with this prop on. Full trigger. Had a little slight hesitation there, huh? Yeah, I had a slight hesitation. Basically full for full throttle. I'm like I'm like feathering in between full and, and three-quarter on these straights Full trigger turn right there Full trigger turn Full trigger One more lap. She really handling like she's on rails, man. I really don't have to 
concentrate, man. I just do my turn and, and she's basically sticking down. Till she, till she hits a little weight, boy, and then she starts doing that cha-cha. So I'm really interested to see what the temperature is with this smaller prop a 1716 compared to my 1916 modified. Oh, usually get in the 140s with this thing here with that 1916. 140s, 150s sometimes. On, usually the back is about 115, 124. The front's like 140. So this prop is hotter. This 1716 is hotter than that modified 1916 that I, that I typically run on here. And it's, uh, let's see, so this is a 43, that's a 47, so about four millimeters uh, smaller. 58, the, the speed is slower. Temps were a little bit higher than normal and but but i could hold it full trigger the whole freaking time you know uh we got 68 with that pretty ass prop right there Woo, doggy so yeah man yeah i'll let you guys go i'm gonna get out this rain